Okay, it's time for the next job. The next one has us uh, going into Workhouse because Ember has been doing some work for them, or at least saying that she's been doing some work for them, uh, but at an inhuman rate, which is, you know, suspicious. So she wants us to go and actually make the, uh, the amount of things that she was able to get done in a single day to be a realistic amount. So, first thing that we're going to do is Execution Agent A is going to grab file 300. This contains Ember's username. So we'll grab 300, copy the name, and we're done with that. Next, we're going to head, link across 800, and we're going to head into the secure host. And in here, we're going to find uh, Ember's file number so we have her username from there we can find the line that has her username the next one's her password which you don't need and then we'll grab the file number so this is going to loop through uh and i've added in a seek here so i don't check every value i'm only checking the actual like first one on each line we find normal human then uh we grab her file number and we're done with file 199 so now we're going to link across 799 we know what her file number is. We've saved it, in, saved it in our X register. We're gonna grab that file. Next, what we're going to do is we're going to jump over to her value. So the first one is uh, her username. The second one is, or it's her name. I, the next one's a date. I don't know what it's for. Uh, but the next few values are all the the amount of money that she's earned each day but she doesn't think that more than $75 is a realistic amount. So she wants to clamp these values, but she still wants to be paid the same amount of money. So what we have to do is we have to take 513 and turn that into multiple instances of being paid 75. And we'll need to do that for all of these values. So we'll need to add all of these values up and replace them so that they're all 75. So it's gonna be a much longer file because there'll be many more 75s to get to the same total, plus whatever that remainder is at the end. So what we do is we have two iterate, not iterations, but we have two sections of this loop. The first one is, well, there are still values that are being added in. We'll loop through. We'll add that value into our X register. So we have 513 now. We are going to subtract 75 from that because we're going to turn 513 into 75. We're going to go back and turn 513 into 75. And we're going to check and see, have we reached the end of the file? Since we haven't, it's going to continue. So now we're going to add 542 into our remaining 438. Subtract 75 and turn 542 into 75. And we're going to continue this pattern, adding up the incremental values until we reach the end of the file. So now we are replacing 574, but we still have $6,391 that still need to be paid out. So what we're going to do now is we're going to enter loop three. Here's another example of me not being good about how I name my loops. Uh, we're now just going to add 75s until this value becomes uh, less than 75. And that's what this next loop is going to do. We just keep on tacking on 75, decrementing the amount for each time we do it. And each time we're just going to be testing is X less than 75. I'm going to use that shortcut. I'm going to hold Alt and click on the next line after the jump so that we can skip ahead to once we actually reach that point. So now we are left with a leftover of 16. We still want to write that, but there's always the chance that the amount was a perfect 75 value. So we only we don't want to write a zero. So we only want to write if the value is over uh, zero. So we test, is it over zero? And since it is, we're going to copy that value in. We are left with the 16 and we're done. Very good. Uh, and this one, you'll see that her I think her her username stays the same, but the file number does change. You see in this one, it's 248, when before it was 246. And of course the amount that she owes each time will also be different. Uh, but it looks like the structure stays the same and file 300 and 199, usually anything that's listed in the prompt will always stay consistent. And yeah, that is that is how we can help ember out to get some more money which is good for us because she pays for the medicine that we use and there we have it